Hello everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Persona 2 Innocent Sin. This is Vita Fuser. In our last episode, we went through room 5 of the Abandoned Factory. We have almost gotten through every single one of the rooms of the Abandoned Factory. Now, as you can see, I have max ranked Indra. That's pretty good. And now that we've got that out of the way, we can also take on one of the four shrines. These four weird buildings that are in all the district that are in each of the four districts are shrines that we have to get the skulls from. Now you can theoretically approach them in any order. However, if you do so, the uh, the layout of the first shrine is going to be different from the others. To make sure we can get, um... To make sure we can get Jun's pers ultimate persona first, we are going into the Hirasaka district. Into the Aquarius shrine. I'm going to save. I'm also slightly overleveled for this. You really want to be at least level 45 before you get into the Aquarius Shrine. Okay. Here we go. Welcome to the Aquarius Shrine. We also have some... Uh, Cards we have to get. Now, I didn't want to do that. Have I got Hermes equipped? I most certainly do have Hermes equipped. Hermes learned Garudine during my uh, Persona grinding. Very nice. Now, you're going to want to have Hermes equipped for the boss fight, because that will allow Jun to get his ultimate persona. That's the sole reason he can't get his. He has to get his by mutation, and you get the modification ability by beating the boss fight of this shrine. You'll know, you'll remember, we only have three shadows here, so, uh, eh. We're not going to be facing Shadow Jun. Okay. If we go to the west, we should find a uh, Tetraja card. Alright, who is this? I hope Melchizedek is in here. And it would appear I am right on the money. Alrighty then, I have, oh, I already have 77, uh, um, Judgment cards, so this isn't actually going to take as long as I thought. So, to get Melchizedek for a contract, we are going to need Tatsia to Persuade. <laughs> You're an interesting one, I'll give you that. Round two. <laughs> yes, I am that foolish. Because it's working. <laughs> I had a good time. How should I reward you? Yes, we're going into a contract. We have too many contracts. So who do we want to annul a contract with? Demeter, Faust, or Kum Awun? You're going to annul Kum Awun. And hopefully I don't mess it up by making him mad. Oh, we got 60 Judgment cards and 45 Tarot cards from uh, Melchizedek. That's very, very nice because we are very, very low on uh, free cards. 
is what I would like to say. I turned out to be wrong. We have 220 free tarot cards. This will help beef up our numbers, because uh, we're going to be relying on those a lot more later. And getting 45 tarot cards per pop is going to be very, very nice. Let's see, there is our Tetraja card. Alright, we are back. Let's see, the southwest corner, we have three magical guards. This is not the southwest corner. Use Nazis, Nazis everywhere. Contract with Melchizedek. Have Melchizedek be the that contract be the only one that you get. Very nice. Jeez. Oh, there's the stairs. All right, we got to be very careful here. There are lots of hidden pitfall traps. Now, in the northeast, there is an item box, but it's empty. So we're going to want to go to the northwest. That was a incredibly disappointing encounter. That was only one Barbados. One. Okay, so... We're going to the northwest. Okay, we're back. I've tried getting Melchizedek to show up again, but he, that's not happening. So anywho... If I'm right, where are we? There's the staircase. And all the way in the northwest corner, that's the relief room we have to go to. Get yourselves ready for a fight, because we are going to be fighting a whole bunch of, uh, of, uh, wind guys. Ah, oh, they actually fought against the Nazis. Okay, so these are the wind guys, which means Jun's gonna be practically useless. This is one, really. True Aquarius mask. Let's see, Crescent Mirror. I don't think I've actually shown any of these. Foamy Lover. And uh, Bloody Honeymoon.
These are expensive, but boy, do they deliver. See what I mean? Wow, you survived. You ain't surviving that, though. Oh, we leveled up. Maya got to level 48, and that's really about it. This relief, it lists four shrines, you see. Order, balance. The Joker, who granted everyone's ideals, died at Caracol. Everyone's rumors gave the Joker the power to grant dreams. The flight of Shibalba was also because of rumors, right? <laughs> Philemon was saying something about someone who's making these rumors become reality. Did he mean Jun's dad? Oh, you have no idea. Everyone in town was relying on Jun to make their dreams come true easily. Nobody would really think it's a good thing, though. It's just that knowing their dreams were within reach, they felt they had to rely on him. It's not because of karma. That's what it means to be human. These four constellations symbolize the Grand Cross. Earth, water, fire, and wind. Each element is accounted for. Earth, water, fire, and wind preserve the world's balance. Each element becomes stronger or weaker based on the others. I heard that from my dad. He studied this philosophical stuff. Shibalba is said to be the temple for the new world, or the template for the new world. And the shrines are symbols of balance in the world. I'm not sure if there's a connection. Alrighty. I really hope I can get uh, Melchizedek to show up again. Sure, I only need about uh, maybe three more uh, rounds of negotiation with Melchizedek. I could easily get those cards from Phalag, but it would take a while. A long while. Phalag only gives you like 12 or so uh, um, judgment cards per pop. Melchizedek gives you 60. And I need the uh, extra card, uh, free tarot cards anyway. Alright, so here is room 2. So. We have to go all the way south until we can't go any further. Alrighty. Down to the south we go. And this is uh, a strength and sense. Nice. Who gets this one? See, you have 53 strength, you have 66 strength. You have 44 strength, you have 37 strength, and you have 49 strength. Mmm. Alright, Maya, you're getting the uh, strength incense. I should have sold these. Ugh. All right, Maya. Up and at him. That. Now we have to go to the north until we can have to get to the east path. Two annoying mask guys. Let's see, go north until 
You see the path to the east. Keep going. And you go southeast from there. Glitches. You just have to get into a fight. Anywho, I have 137 judgment cards. I need two more rounds of negotiation with Melchizedek in order to be able to afford one of my next Persona summonings. So I will try and get some more. Because this last room is the, or the next room is the last room. So I will see you guys in a bit. Alright, this is the last uh, negotiation with uh, Melchizedek. I figure I may as well show you how to get his contract. Or not how to get his contract, but how to get his cards. Self-intoxicate is your friend. Oh, why, oh, why did I have to be born this beautiful? Look at this good's gotta be a sin. That's right, a sin. Oh, Father, please forgive me. <laughs> is that so? You're that narcissist I've heard about in all these rumors. This is interesting. Come, let us pray. I'm sorry, I had to get in the merciful clergyman in there. <laughs> no matter what, his voice dubbing is absolutely freaking hilarious. Greek mythology tells us of a young man who was changed into the Narcissus flower, and there he remains, constantly staring at his own reflection in the water. Yeah, he's gonna be a persona in about a few games. Would you be happy being turned into a Narcissus? I'm already more beautiful than some old flower. <laughs> what? Who knew that a Narcissus could make me so angry? I came all this way to meet you, the least we could do is hear what the other has to say. If there's something you'd like to ask me, feel free. What's the meaning of life? I didn't expect you would think so deeply about this. I'm pleased you've put this much thought into this. I see. I'm glad we were able to meet like this. I have a small gift for you. That's right, I'll give you 60 of these judgment cards. And 45 free tarot cards as well. Stay out of trouble. Yeah! I no longer have to get any more cards from this place. I will save and we can go... up to the third floor. Alright, third floor. We have another relief room later. We have a Trish's Fountain in the northeast from the entrance and in the south corner there should be an item box. Alright, that was just more mask, guys. Alright, here's the item box. We got 50,000 yen. Nice. And the way we're going, we're going to need some better equipment. Now that I no longer have to worry about getting any more coins from the casino, I can put these towards better equipment for us. Okay. To the northwest now. Okay, there's that. We have to go to the northwest now. Oh, it's right there. I'm gonna run around and get some more of Lisa's uh, hit point or uh, shadow points back. So I will be back in a bit. Okay, so I'm actually going to not run around to get regenerating 
shadow points right now because if I'm right, then in this room, um, Jun, Lisa, and Akichi are going to level up. That's if I'm right. I could be wrong. Here we go. They got some Nazis here. Blade of Fury. We're going to take care of those guys. And Bloody Honeymoon. I haven't shown Bloody Honeymoon quite yet. Alright. Show them what we got. Blade of Fury. Go, Indra, go. Down you go. Down you go. Down you go. Boy, down you go. Goodbye. Don't say anything. Not again. Jun's always brooding over things, ever since he was a kid. Listen, ho oh, ho. Doesn't that make you feel better? Ho oh, oh, ho oh. ho ho. That's not it at all, Jun. Didn't you say you wanted to become a school teacher a long time ago? A school teacher is the kind of person who guides students to their ideals, right? I think it'd be great if you became the kind of teacher that teaches everyone to appreciate their dreams. The sign of Aquarius. It embraces the wind element, and it symbolizes revolution and destruction, evolution and charity. That's just a name alone. The truth is it's a symbol for a conceited fool. There's no way I would really be able to lead people to their ideals. <laughs> Leave the halls to me, the great Michelle. Okay, everybody, come on, say it with me, let's... change with Kichi. Never change. Okay. So, beyond that door is the last part of the third floor. You gotta head all the, let's see. That has a tech card and then the Aquarius room. Good news is, we are at the level to fight this boss fight and, and Jun has Hermes. All I really have to do is make sure I get there with full shadow points. Because this next boss fight, bit tough. Let's see, I will save right here just in case something bad happens. You can never be too careful. Alrighty. Okay, there's that. Okay, let's see. I'm not gonna get that tech card. There's no real... I don't really use cards to enhance personas. I really don't. Alright, there is the Aquarius room. Everyone's nearly uh, topped up.
but I'm going to run around and get more shadow points anyway. See you in a bit. Okay, that'll be about enough. We are ready to go. In the Aquarius room we go. How pitiful. This puppet continues to dance, despite knowing nothing. Yet all flowers are bound to wilt. Can we measure their transience in the stars? Flowers are irreplaceable. I'm here to take back the crystal skull of the wind. Alrighty! Longinus, five, six, and seven. I take it you got your memories back, little puppet. What do you mean by that? Of course I remembered everything. Everyone suffered because of me. Because of what I've done. As foolish as ever. Every flower wilts in the end, of course. Alrighty. 5, 6, and 7 have 2600, 2500, and 2700 hit points, respectively. This is going to be the big one that we level up on. Now, use lots and lots of uh, spells that hit lots of people. Strategy. I think we're going to switch this up and show off what uh, Apollo can do. Nova Kaiser. What am he really? Oh, brother. Maragi Dine. That'll do it then. Maragi Dine, Foamy Lover, Crescent Mirror, Bloody Honeymoon, and Wind Slash. Okay. Are you sure you don't have any uh, um, multiple hitting attacks? Mug. Pitiful damage. It's a good thing we're just going to, uh. Ah, oh, Gardine, then. You know what? Sona. Maybe a ROM. Honeymoon. They haven't done anything quite yet, so... Uh...
one of them's down. That's good. Maya can't attack now. Kurimba, don't you dare hit. You didn't hit. Okay, good. This is why you need Hermes equipped. He will be able to evolve into Jun's ultimate persona now. Level up time! Oh, we leveled up too! Nice, nice, nice! Alright, 47 vitality. We will survive more. Michelle is up. Nice. Ginkgo is up more. Nice. Jun is up more. Nice. Maya didn't level up? Why did Maya level up? Ha <laughs> ha, you fool. You don't have a clue who's behind all of this. What? Ugh! Are you okay, Jin? Yeah. I'm okay. We gotta hurry and get that skull. If you listen closely, this is a remix of the poem of the everyone's soul. I am the skull of the wind. If I sleep, nothing will disturb the earth, and the flames will lose their power. Let's hurry to the next temple. One skull down. With that out of the way, I think we will cut it here. So I will see you guys next time.